We run this tra uh, Leaders Training Skills Weekend every year to, for leaders uh, who are experienced to pass on their skills to uh, up and coming leaders and also leaders who are, who've been in the um, scouting for many years wish to learn new skills. I think it came about because uh, we're a group of leaders within Altside uh, feeling there was a need for uh, some bushcraft backward skills. Lots of leaders are coming through without the core skills that you need to pass on to, to the children really so I think it's important that we, we develop them skills with, with what we've got and open up to other leaders. Uh, over the years it's, it's, it's grown and it's become uh, a good, good base for people to learn new skills and then they can pass it down to their own scouts. I came because it came the year before last it was so good I thought I can't miss this. I'm determined to be here and I'm here this year. Running this weekend to inspire leaders, to be able to inspire scouts, doing some of the more wild outdoor stuff. Um, I thought come this year because the parents were really good and like everyone said the skills you learn are amazing so I just thought try it. Basically we're running it to pass on our adult skills uh, that we have um, onto other leaders basically, so that's what we're after. I mean, this weekend is great, you know, because there's tons of scout leaders. And, uh, it's very important for me to sort of, like, with my knowledge, is to is to pass it over to the scout leaders, and then subsequently they can pass it over to their groups. So uh, my background is sort of, like woodlands and forestry and, and bushcraft and things like that. So this is the fifth year doing this event, and I keep getting asked back in anyway, which is a good thing. Yeah, the base today I'm working on is Sycamore Lodge, which is actually a, a project we built three years ago, sadly, which got a bit destroyed and we're having to rebuild it. Uh, this weekend I'm doing what we call Greenwood um, work, basically. I'm, and at the moment I'm mending the lodge because unfortunately it got damaged and a little bit of uh, wear and tear on it. So we're repairing the Sycamore Lodge. Uh, this weekend uh, I've been focusing on axe skills, uh, teaching people to use axes, fell, fell trees, cut trees, split trees. It's surprising the amount of leaders who've never ever felled a tree or cut a tree or used an axe and uh, you can see with on the faces the, the, uh, the, the, the joy of, of, being, of achieving something really, which was, it's, it's great to watch. been uh, helping some leaders start fires using different techniques. Uh, one of the techniques we use is using steel, flint, um, onto some cotton wool and then putting very very fine twigs over the top and starting a fire with a single match. Um, so today, um, this is uh, day one, um, and uh, we've done a, a two-hour wild walk. So 
walking around the woodlands looking at trees and plants and, and things like that, uh, some wild foods and animal tracks and signs. Um, and then we've um, uh, prepared a, a couple of salmon uh, and some uh, chicken. Uh, one of the salmon and the chicken has gone on the, uh, uh, the smoker, another one's been uh, being cooked by the fire. Uh, and also I've done uh, like an ad hoc, sort of like not factory if you like, with, uh, with a few of the leaders which, uh, which went down really well. Yeah, we recommend that people come uh, to the Leader Skills Weekend, whether you're a novice leader or you're an experienced leader, because it's always new skills, either you can learn or you can even pass on. And it's a great way for leaders to communicate and pass on physical, hands-on skills, which we can then go on to pass on to our children in scouting. Because the, the skills you learn, there's people, so many scout leaders haven't got a clue what they're doing. And this is really, this is people who know what they're doing. So you, you know, you get the proper instruction, not like on board with this. There's so much scout training, you think, do I want to be here? This, I want to be here, it's really good, yeah. You get that opportunity to learn additional skills which you can take back and show to young people. It's basically, they need to come so they can learn good skills to take back to their own group and uh, encourage their own kids in some more natural things that scouting's all about. We think. I think it's a great weekend for people to, to get together to see what other groups are doing uh, in the district, uh, what can be done and, and it brings up a, a group of friendship between the scout leaders and, and I think success breeds success. People should come to these weekends to inspire, inspire themselves, get into what the real meaning of scouting is which is making do with what's around you and uh, being prepared for every eventuality uh, but also having lots of fun whilst you're doing it. For me, this is sort of like what scouting is all about, really. Uh, getting young people out, learning different skills. And, uh, but also, it's important that um, scout leaders have this knowledge as well to, to pass it on. <laughs>